Well, it's not a change of attitude. They're, they're following the public relations uh, book on this, which is you, you lay low, see what's going to happen, see if it kind of goes away or starts bubbling up, and then you plan your response. Uh, the difficulty here is that uh, you know it, he's had a number of run-ins which point to moral blindness. Whether or not they had that level of insight uh, during this entire process, I'm not sure if we all know that. Uh, going forward, the public needs to know, like, this is the definition of wake-up call. And as long as you continually provide your data to these companies, you know, without any reservation, uh, it is just a matter of time until you as a consumer are going to make decisions that are influenced in ways that you did not initially think that could be done so. People do not know what they're signing up to, and they do not expect that once they sign on to what seems an innocuous uh, you know, survey, that their information is going to be used in ways, not only their information, but the information of their friends. Remember, we're talking about 226,000 people who took this, but 50 million people whose information was reached. So I think it's a bit of a stretch to say that, you know, you signed up for this, you know, just take it on the chin and all this.